This is the Ultra X3 1600 watt power supply during the full load testing portion of our review. Uh, the power supply is on, has been running. Uh, currently the power supply is doing approximately 1586 watts DC output. Today's test is being conducted slightly different. The only active testing equipment on is the SM8800. This is due to the extreme load this power supply places on the 20 amp circuit we have available for testing. Uh, I've actually offloaded the SM8800 onto a second circuit so that I don't keep tripping the circuit, uh, which is currently holding. The way we've loaded this today is 117 amps, 12 volt. We do this with 20 amps on one PCI Express connector, 20 amps on another PCI Express connector, 26 amps on a third, 25 amps on the P4 aux, 26 amps on the ATX connector. Additionally, we have 22 amps on the, plus, uh, on the 5 volt rail, 15 amps on the 3.3 volt rail, 2 amps on the plus 5 VSB, and 0.5 on the minus 12 volt rail. Power supply is on, it's holding, the circuit's holding, which is good. And we're still doing 1,585 watts. This, part, this test is 10 minutes in. Uh, it'll continue for the next 20 minutes as our usual testing. But like I said earlier, the only test equipment on is the load tester. So the power supply is being run at room temperature. Um, unfortunately, this is due to the load that's placed on the circuit and can't be avoided. Uh, this is the Ultra X3 1,600 watt power supply.